This is a true horrifying story of a man who read the book Shams al-Ma'arif. Shams al-Ma'arif is one of the world's most dangerous books. It carries one of the most dangerous rituals of summoning demons. Stay away from this book if you ever see it. This story took place in Egypt about two years ago. I there are a couple of pages, around four or five pages inside this book, somewhere in the middle. They contain names of jinns. Part of the ritual is reading all these names, and one of the jinns on these pages will be summoned. A man in Egypt got this book from an old friend. His friend warned him many times about reading the book, but he insisted. Before the owner gave him the book, he ripped out these four or five pages that contain the names of the jinns. Because out of all rituals in the book, that one specifically is the most dangerous one. He rips the pages out and hands him the book. That friend takes the book back home and starts reading it. As he reads the book, strange things would happen. He would hear knocks inside his house. Small things would light up on fire, and the tap water would run in the toilets. He knew such things would happen. He ignored everything and continues reading the book. All of a sudden, someone outside rings the doorbell. His whole body froze from fear. He opens the door and sees a short, old man. He looked very unusual. His feet were abnormally big. The skin on his face seemed like it was rubber, and his hands were as dry as a rock. The old man looks at him and says, Stop reading the book. And then he left. Ever since that day, wherever this guy goes, he would see that old man everywhere. At the supermarket, at the gas stations, outside mosques, in his neighborhood. This guy decided to give the book back to his friend. When he gave the book back to the real owner, the owner immediately turns to the pages that he ripped out before handing him the book. And he witnessed something terrifying. The pages that were ripped out were stitched back inside the book. He quickly asked him if he reached and read those pages. He said yes. Ever since I read this chapter, this old man has been following me everywhere. 